What's good, YouTube? It's your boys, the Yelks. It's the legendary one. And today we're doing a showcase on Orihime. Now, Orihime is not somebody I would say you need to get on the banner. I'd say probably she's top two worst you can pull. Obviously, Aizen being the worst, her being the second worst in my opinion. Um, reason being, it's not that she's a bad character. My only problem with her is that she's a, a human-affiliated character, which means it's going to be so difficult to get her accessories and her best set and all that stuff. Because humans... I don't know, bro. Maybe Soul Reapers and stuff, but humans, in my mind, um, that's just some, not, something you don't want to have to deal with. But um, Orihime, in general, is a good character. Again, besides the human affiliation thing, I think uh, she's a good character, a decent character. I did get her 10-10-10 one day. Um, I think it was on stream where I was just like, yeah, Orihime, you know, she's pretty good. You know, um, yeah, I know why a lot of people do like Orihime. I don't like her one bit, though. Uh, but I will say her character is good, but let's get into what she can do and I'll show you guys what I got on her But before we do that make sure you guys subscribe and like because we're on the road to 2,000 subscribers Um by the end of the year and we hit that before if you guys hit the sub. Yeah, okay, so Orihime here. Let's see Um hollow killer pretty good. Um strong attack recharge time negative 12% very good She is a sp character with 790 sp just two off of 800 so I'll give it to her She has a heal and a shield on her second strong attack with Bruiser and Berserker, 20%. Devastation, 40%. Frenzy, plus 1. Very good. Weakened Defense, very good. Medic and Healer, plus 30. With Sprinter, plus 1. I will say this Orihime is pretty good. And I'm pretty sure she is a ranged character. So, I will say this Orihime is a fantastic character. Um, again, not one of the best red characters in the game. But a very decent character. Like, she's an option. She's a range 2. So, you have something there, too. Again, Human Affiliation. The best I could give her, honestly, was a Zeta Pill... Uh, fortification pill and a hunting cap this is like the best thing i could give her because i don't know what the human accessory is one for sp and i uh, hunting cap is just all i had that was gonna work for her anyways um we got rukia and double 14 percent here so 12 percent and double 14 percent for recharge time and uh yeah anyways let's just get into iz and see how well orihime does it has been a minute since i used her but i'll see you guys when we get into iz all right, guys, so we're here in IZ um, or Hime. I will say her attack is pretty good for someone who has, like, not even great accessories on right now. Um, her Nad string, you've probably have seen it somewhere. I don't know, maybe the fake out from the animation summons, especially that triangle part right there. Um, right, you've definitely seen that. Um, but let's see. I like her Nad string, though. So what's she doing? 1.3K, 1.5K on her Nad string there. Pretty okay for her accessories she has. Um... I will say her dash is not that bad, eh? I kind of like her dash. She's like gliding with it. Hold on. Hold on, Morihime. You gliding with it. Her first strong attack is um a, tr a three-way beam. Is that what that was? Not beam, but like three-way blast. I think I might like that strong attack. Whoa, hold up. A three-way blast is pretty good because it's just going to cover more ground. Honestly, I kind of like that one. Okay, second strong attack is the heal and shield. It does do damage, but again, she does put a shield on you. So she is a great support. I will give her that. She is a great support. Her one giving shields and then two healing al uh, allies. Oh, <laughs> her third strong attack was nice. I'm not going to lie. Um, I really do like her third strong attack a lot. Um, she's not really doing that much damage, though. Like I, The highest I've seen so far was 4.6, um, which means she's doing... 9.2 9.2 or point three was there so yeah 9.6 i think that was yeah i mean she's okay character again like i said definitely not one of the characters you need to pull on the banner um but the as you see in there the poison hits that poison hits a lot but it completely protected us there the shield at least so something like that's where you, i bro her third strong attack is so sick i never even I don't remember it looking like that. It's probably like now that I'm seeing it again, it's probably one of my favorites. I put it top 10. I kind of like, I really like this one. It's like, wow, Orihime. And I don't even like Orihime. So there's no, okay. So there, got paralyzed. I didn't know he paralyzed, right? Okay, that's not bad. Um, so far, she's doing okay. We did lose damage or uh, late HP, but then again, we have a heal. So. Um, having, again, some, like, full stamina damage on her wouldn't be bad as well if she could just constantly heal herself, um, like, every 15 seconds, I'd say. 
Um, and then she gives herself a shield too. So if you actually just play it, you should be fine with her. Right? I think full stamina damage with this girl would be a play. Um, like I said, she has a heal. And then again, she gives herself a shield. So something like that wouldn't be bad. And she has medic and healer and all that stuff. It's actually just pretty broken. Like, I'd say she's a good support, right? And that's why I got her 10 10 10. I remember I said in my live stream um, that, like, if I ever just want to use be a support and heal and shield everyone, this is where she come in clutch. Um, I wish for her resurrection they changed it that, or maybe for a resurrection, giving her multi barrier might be nice, honestly. If the I don't know whenever these characters are going to get a resurrection, but whenever they do, maybe giving her multi barrier might be nice. Um, I don't think it's something she needs to have, but obviously, multi barrier is in a bad skill. Let's use her ultimate. We're going to see a special guest in her ultimate, actually, if you guys know what I mean. So I'll pull up the volume a bit, but you guys will see a special guest in her ultimate. Twenty K, bro. What? That was not bad. That was pretty good there. Um, as you guys seen, we did see Ichigo in the ultimate. Let me just turn this down a bit. I'm not allowed to this. But we, you guys, did see Ichigo in the ultimate there. So, a Ichigo does make an appearance in her ultimate. So, if you do like Ichigo and Orihime together, this is your type of character. Um, I do like her ultimate a lot though. Um, you know, her and Ichigo just walking up the stairs to God. Not really, but um, it's really nice. I really do like this. Um. Like, it's pretty nice. It's pretty nice. I really do like it. She doesn't have a thing. So, as you see right there, something like that. Where is a uh, thing? We have ourselves a shield now. So, it doesn't matter if they attack us. Yeah. I'd say she's pretty good. I'd say she's pretty good. Um, Yeah. From what I've seen today, a very decent character. Right? Very good support, in my opinion. I will give her that. Healer plus 30? Was it? What was it? Healer plus 30% and medic with a heal and a shield that you can basically proc every 15 seconds with the uh, links that I had. Um, it's pretty good, I will say. So if you guys it did pull Orihime, it wasn't out at all because if you decide to be a support, keep in mind what mine is 10-10-10. Um, I would say probably having her 10-10-10 is the play. Um, I'm not sure exactly how well she would do without 10-10-10, but I would say having her 10-10-10 is the play. I mean, I think I, last time I did a showcase on her, she was in 10, 10, 10. So if you want to go to my old showcase on her, go ahead. But besides all that, she was okay. Um, would I ever use her again? Like I said, if I decide to use a support. But you know what? You guys deserve it. I'll give you guys a little. There. Oh my. Her kid. <laughs> I don't like her either, but. Uh, this character is pretty decent. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed these three and I'll see you guys tomorrow with Yamamoto, Soifan, and Aizen Showcase. Um, let me know if you guys pulled these characters, if you're enjoying these characters, and let me know again how your summons have went, as always. It's your boys, Yaxis, and I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm out later. Peace!